I'm gonna get the, uh, the German potato salad going here. New potatoes. Just for flavor. I'm just gonna chop up a couple of onions and cold water. Okay, put these on the fire. Salt, gotta put some salt. Let them cook. This is gonna be for the potato salad. Get a nice smoky slab bacon. I mean, really, how many better things in the world are there than bacon? When you put bacon in something, it tastes good. People love bacon. I do, for sure. I want just to kind of cook actually a little slowly. Get all the fat renders and it gets nice and crispy. Potatoes, actually, they have a little ways to go. We can let those cook. And as they cook, we can actually strain out the bacon and start to make the vinaigrette. The dressing for the potato salad. I'm gonna strain all this out, all the bacon. I'm gonna put this back on the fire, heat that up a little bit. We're gonna cook the onions right in there, right in the bacon fat. All right, let's strain out the potatoes. This is the way you check them. Knife goes in without any resistance. They're done. All right, here's the key. Whenever you make potato salad, any kind of potato salad, you want to cut up the potatoes and you want to dress them while it's still warm. Why? Because the starch is going to be sort of open, the pores are going to be open. It's going to be a lot easier for the dressing to become part of the potatoes, and that's what you want. Otherwise, if the potatoes are too cold, the potatoes will actually repel the dressing, and we don't want that. We don't want, we don't want all these separate flavors. We want it all to be one. Get these into here. Let's make the dressing. Bacon. Vinegar, add to our onions and our bacon fat. Scallions. Put lots of green onions in here. Okay, some mustard, some olive oil, salt and pepper. Let's fold it in, see what happens here. See, this is not a mayonnaise-based potato salad. This is more like a vinegar-based potato salad, a little bit of olive oil, some mustard, bacon, scallions, that good bacon fat, no doubt.